What is up, YouTube? Yes, I know my screen is upwards. I don't give a crap. I just do this for fun. Um. So y'all probably seen the fucking shit that's going on around in this fucking world with the fucking riots and the cops killing George Floyd and all that, but... Let me tell you something. Going around and fucking busting supermarkets windows out and shit like that is not going to help anybody. It's not going to help the situation. And you need to realize that because you're supposed to be setting an example. How you, how your kids going to learn if Hell, I'd hate to do this, but I gotta quote my man church. How are you gonna learn from mistakes we made in the past when you were racing that shit like you want it to relapse? Hmm. I wonder why he wrote that line. Maybe because you motherfuckers out there that think it's okay to riot and shit in big fucking cities and shit like that. No. You set an example for your kids. No, what those cops did was not right. No, they will probably... No. No, they won't get away with it. But, the fact of the matter is, you don't go around fucking destroying other people's property that isn't yours. And the sooner you realize that, the sooner you'll be... Meaning the better you'll be, better off. Fucking listen to it, listen to the fucking police officers. Uh, and if they don't do anything, well, fuck, what do I know, right? All I'm saying is don't do this to yourselves because it's gonna make it a lot worse on you and your kids. I mean, hell, you're setting buildings on fire. You're fucking, uh, doing whatever the hell you want with your fucking riot signs and Black Lives Matter fist of power. Oh, no. You got to handle this rationally and calmly. Yes, Black Lives Matter, but everybody's lives matter. That includes the safety of the police officers and their kids and everybody else that is in this world. Because of the fact of the matter is, yes, a cop car ran over some people. Yes, it was fucked up. Yes, they should be in prison. Yes, they should get repercussions for this. But... Let me tell you something. Fucking uh, beating up cops and shit like that when they're outnumbered. That's fucking pussy shit. And let me tell you something, Felicia. This is not going to help anybody. You're just making it worse on yourself and everybody around you. And when I say that, what I mean is basically you're going to fuck this country up over something that happens every day. Black people are always being discriminated. Does it mean that we should start a big riot? Fuck no. Fuck no. You use your fucking brain, you stupid fucks. Use your brain. I know you're standing up for something you believe in, but destroying the city and shit is not gonna help. At least fucking Des Moines, Iowa is smart. They actually, their cops fucking kneeled down and prayed with them. And they stopped the riot. 
Why can't your cities do that? I don't know. The country's fucking changed since I was a kid. And I'll say that with my fucking pride. The country has changed since I was a kid. You know what? When I was a kid, we didn't have to worry about this shit. I mean, sure, we had to worry about 9-11 and all those other fucking... events that happened, but... Never had to worry about discrimination. Never had to worry about whether or not I'm going to be able to have friends around other people that are mixed. Because I, ha I have fucking cousins that are black, dude. They're mixed. So, for you fucking cops killing that dude, and for no fucking reason... Jackie was struggling to get in the car because he probably didn't know what he did. You don't fucking explain your... You didn't ever fucking explain his rights to him. You fucking retards. If you're a cop and you over-abuse your fucking power, you need to be fired. And you deserve to burn in hell. Because that was not okay in any fucking way. You think it's okay for people to just fucking kneel their leg or their knee on someone's neck and not be able to breathe? That person has kids. He's a father. A grandfather probably too. I mean, come the fuck on. Use your fucking heads. And get your heads out of your ass. Because this country is getting worse and worse every year. And it's not going to stop until we are all gone. And I'm going to be fucking happy when I'm gone. Because this shit is fucking out of control and ridiculous. At least I think personally. Because there's other ways to solve this than starting riots and causing drama that doesn't even need to be started. Don't be like these people. Yes, fight for what you believe in, but don't be destroying shit. Love you guys.